Hey guys, welcome back. This is John with Love the Hunt. This is the new purchase we just got. Uh, it is the Emperor 12 gauge and it's like a home defense shotgun. It's got a nice little pad here on the on the end, rubber pad. I'm sure that won't be sufficient enough for this lightweight 12 gauge. But it has uh, adjustments here for like a cheek piece riser. And it's numbered 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. You loosen this and it'll it'll notch up. It's got notches behind there. It's got uh, shell holders here. You can put four extra rounds inside. And I cannot remember how many rounds it holds. We'll test that out in a little bit. I think it's four rounds in the, the gun. But it's got an AR style pistol grip there. A little triangular safety on it. But let's see, that's Emperor. Yep. Kind of a neat design and the low gate opens easily i have this is made in turkey i have a turkish made verona semi-automatic and it has a button that i have to push on the side to get my rounds to go up in there and i don't care for it it's just i i like it open like my remington 870 super mag that i have but uh going on down here you got a unique little handle pump handle it's a little thicker there uh, at the end of it. So you put your hand up here in front of it and it kind of gives you a grip to pull back. It's got a little pick rail on the bottom. You can put a light or whatever you want there on the bottom of it. And uh, it's got 18 half inch barrel. It's 12 gauge, two and three quarter or three inch magnum. And it's also got a rail up here. You can mount a little red dot or whatever if you'd like. Now the end of the sight down here, kind of disappointed, but it is just black. I don't think there's a dot in there I can even see, but uh, we're going to probably paint that up where we can see a little better. And it does not have a choke. It is just a cylinder bore in it. So we're going to run a few rounds here outside. and see how she does let's see if I can read that right there hold still and yeah, it won't focus on me I can't tell what it is it says armament I'm not sure exactly what that is there but we're uh, we're gonna take it out here and test it out I like it overall uh, I'm sure until I shoot it and then I may not like it very much so if you see this on sale on one of the gun sites you'll know why <laughs> all right guys we're going to take it out here I'm going to pause the video and we're going to shoot a few rounds now we're set up here in the kitchen or you can see it a little bit better with the wooden table background go down here a little bit comes with this in the chamber what we're going to do is come out here. I got some rounds out. I was at Academy the other day and I had these Remington uh, Sure Shot Heavy Dove. They are 12 gauge, 2 and 3 quarter, 1255 feet per second on the velocity. Now that's 1 and 1 eighth ounce of shot. So you have a little bit more shot and 7.5 shot size for the doves. And uh, they've seemed to do well in the past for me. So I grabbed a couple up. I th think they were on sale for nine something, nine sixty nine, something like that per box at Academy. But uh, here's the little booklet that comes with the shotgun, Emperor Firearms. I got a few different rounds out here. These are just your standard two and three quarter inch, uh, one ounce with uh, number uh, seven shot in these do doves or whatever but back here we got some select rounds like a Rio 21 pellet Royal Buck and those two let's see this one here it's high bias. Whoop. Uh, I think that's 21 pellets as well just read that 
Yeah, I believe that's 21 pellets. Double lot buck. I got a couple of those. And this one here is Super X 9 pellet. So that's heavy. It's a heavier round, bigger pellets. These back here are a Remington, I think it is, Home Defense Defender. Two and three quarter inch. And I believe that was around. No, that's Winchester. Those are Winchester Home Defense rounds, both of those. <clears throat> well, these here are a special round I got. That's Remington Ultimate Defense Managed Recoil Buckshot. And I'm not sure how many pellets is in that. Here we go. 12 gauge, 2 and 3 quarter length, 1200 feet per second velocity, 21 pellets, 4 BK buckshot. So uh, that's a home defense that's uh, managed recoil, so it doesn't have as much powder and hopefully won't go through, you know, someone's coming in your house that's coming in your house and go through the wall and hit somebody else you don't want to in the family. So I got those a little while back. You can tell by the price tag, $5.99. They're, they're much more expensive now. But what we're going to do is we're going to run out here and pop off just a few rounds in the dark now. And uh, probably just these basic loads here, maybe one of the, the high brass to see how it does. We're going to go ahead and load it up here in the load gate for the first time. We got just a regular like bird shot, seven, two and three quarter inch length. Four the bugs are killing me here. I just got three in there. I put four back here where you can see it. See the rounds in there? Mm -hmm. Goes right up in place. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and pump it. Stand back here a little. Uh, can you see the target down there at all, Heather? A little bit. A little bit. All right. I release the bolt. Okay. Pop. And it's going in. All right. Plug your ears. Point it at that uh, target down there. Watch the end of the barrel if you can. I'm just going to shoot in that general direction. You ready? Watch the end of the barrel. There it goes. Watch the Ooh end of the wee. barrel. Alright, we'll try it again. That time I aimed at the steel target. One more round. Boy, I tell you what, that's going to get a nice stiff hit to it. Now I've got a magnum in here. Point at the end of the barrel. I'm just going to drop it here in the front. This is a uh, double lot buck. I'm going to just shoot right down there in the woods. Can you see the front of the gun head? Yeah. All right, here it goes. Hopefully I'll remain to keep my teeth. Good gravy. That was a lot. <laughs> a lot of recoil. I think I hear the coyotes. Yep, yeah. cow packs right out there. <laughs> we can just we shoot hear them in the all butt. the time. Heather or Jake, go ahead and get the lanterns up. We're going to go back in. Well, I'm pretty impressed with it. I think it'll do the job. We're going to have a little bit more fun with it later on, but we'll talk to you guys later.